Hello everyone, Nas with you. Today we're gonna talk about the new patch, battle pass, new main menu, harbor. I hope you like that video, I'll try to explain my opinion. So let's start watching. So as you can see, now we have play, career, battle pass, collection, agent, store on the left side. So it's pretty interesting, I don't know. How do you feel? But uh, uh, it's pretty interesting for me. First of all, we're gonna start talking about the battle pass. Uh, I don't know, like you will like it or not. Uh, for me, it's like always some radiant points, right? So then we have Marshall, we have Judge. Uh, what else we have? We have Guardian. We have Bulldog, Sheriff Skin, uh, Shorty. Opa, Yoru. We have Vandal skin also. We have Opa Cypher. We're still waiting for the Cypher buff, right? Cypher buff. Always watching spray. Uh, Bucky. Uh, Spectre. What kind of knife we do we have? That's uh, Odin skin. That's Operator. Uh, that's a knife, and that's a uh, ghost skin. So pretty, not bad, I guess. Not bad. So one more time, Marshall, Judge, Guardian, Bulldog, Sheriff, Shorty, Vandal skin. Bucky, Spectre, Odin, Operator, Knife and Ghost. So now, now we talk about about the new agent. So actually, there is nothing changed. So it's only agent, and uh, we will see how does it feel. Uh, my opinion about that agent and. Uh, We'll talk about his abilities. First of all, you have to see what... Well, look, look at that, look at that. Opa! So, we have uh, abilities. First ability is a wave that cost uh, 150. Uh, that's a sphere that cost 350. That's ability wall which is uh, recovering and we have ulti if i'm not wrong it's seven orbs yeah so so we're gonna start from the first ability uh it calls uh cascade so what is that ability it's just uh, throwing the wave like this look uh, as i understand it's going for five seconds and after that then you're gonna put it it's just staying for five seconds also as you can see so pretty simple ability pretty interesting you can stop it when you want just pressing the same button and it can uh, as you can see just stop also i'll show you then then you're going through it doesn't matter when he's when it's going when it's stuck you're getting slowed for a second so maybe like a cypher cage in the previous so pretty interesting ability also you can put it through the walls so it doesn't matter as you can see you can you can see the final position of that on the radar. So, the second ability, sphere, the orb, I don't know, I'm gonna call it orb, okay? So, it, it costs 350. So, what's the point of it? You can throw it left click, right click, doesn't matter. It creates that kind of orb, uh, which is staying for 15 seconds. 15. But if people, listen, uh, it's staying for 15 seconds, but it has uh, HP. Uh, 500 if, uh, HP if I'm not wrong, so fire. it's staying for 15 seconds, but if people gonna shoot it, it's gonna disappear instantly. I don't know, it has to be 500, I still don't know, but if I'm not wrong, it's like 13 bullets with phantom, so we can count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. You are not getting damage inside of the warp until the people not destroy it. So you can easily just put it maybe while you're defuning the spike. But don't forget that it's like the sage wall. People could easily destroy it. So 13 bullets is not a lot for that, to be honest. And uh, that's how it works. After that, we have third ability, which is recovering. 40 seconds it takes for recover, so for the turn. 
It uh, looks like it's the same as the Viper Wall, but it's a bit uh, not huge as a Viper Wall. And we also can uh, move it like a Phoenix Wall, as you can see. We can, we can shoot through that wall, but we're getting the same thing like uh, the first ability. Yeah, I didn't say the first ability, we can shoot through it also. But we're getting slowed, as you can see. This wall staying for 12 seconds, if I'm not wrong. And uh, yeah, as I showed you, you can just throw it like this, and it's going through the walls, and it's putting like this, like a viper wall. And staying for 12 seconds, and you're also getting slowed, and uh, you just can move it as you want as you can see i know maybe that's not a good ball but pretty interesting and the last thing what we have we have ultimate so ultimate i guess i have to show you on range range we're gonna see how is that working so we're just putting ulti and luckily we don't have okay we have brother we're putting ulti look we're getting stunned three times one two everybody gets stunned three and it's over that's done like for second or for two seconds. Let me check with you. Should be one second. One, ah, maybe two, two seconds then. So it takes two seconds and everybody stunned. So it looks like the Astra stun, but it takes two seconds, but you're getting stunned three times. So it should be six seconds. Man, my math is pretty, you know, it's pretty good. So my opinion about that agent uh, looks like interesting. 100% first time is gonna be super uncomfortable to play that agent like it always happens like it was happening with the Yoru But I'm not sure that that agent gonna be playable on all of the maps He's gonna feel better on long maps like Icebox, Breeze And I feel like Pearl is also gonna be not bad for him So Breeze is more interesting I guess for that agent even Icebox But I feel like on Pearl he also could feel not bad. I mean, if you are gonna remember A side, B side, pretty interesting how he gonna put the abilities, how his wall gonna work. So might be he gonna feel pretty, pretty good about the other maps, Ascent, Bind, Heaven, uh, Fracture. I don't know right now. It's pretty hard to say right now a lot about that agent, but I feel like he could be playable on long maps. We'll see how he gonna feel on the close maps, like I explained already. I hope you like that video, I hope you like the new Agent Harbor, I don't know right now how's that gonna be in the future, how's he gonna feel himself in competitive, in official games, in ranked, it's pretty hard to say right now, because uh, we don't know how people gonna use this agent in the future, but I'm pretty sure on some kind of maps maybe people will use it so anyway, just write down in the comments your opinion about that agent, your opinion about the patch and uh, of course, don't forget to leave a like and follow my channel. So thank you for the watching and see you in the next videos. Bye-bye.